This has to be the sexiest solar panel attachment system that I have ever installed. I'm taking a look at the SMR hitched roof attachment setup from Sun Moto. One of my favorite things about this system is the part count is so small. Everything has been reduced to one tool and everything has multiple functions. If you just look at this nano mount, it is a direct to deck attachment with four screws on the outside of it, or it's a rafter attachment with one lag screw in the center. Same mount, multiple uses. You have a little bit of a channel on the top where there's a T-bolt style um, accessory for grounding and for mounts, uh, optimizers, uh, micro inverters, or uh, rapid shutdown devices. The mid clamp has like a circular washer on the top of it and it has prongs on the outside and it clips and grabs onto the side of the rail um, and then slides underneath the panel. And the end clamps are similar and you're also able to do like 30 millimeter, 40 millimeter, universal with all panel thicknesses. One of the things that I instantly fell in love with with this product is the clicks. Every single product just clicks into place and you can slide it easily and then tighten it in. So everything is single tool. You only need one tool to install everything on this roof. Okay, so looking at this system, it is not a channel rail. It's an enclosed rail. It sits in a saddle. I do like the channel rail because you can tuck all your wires in there. And, but let me tell you where they're coming from with this product. When you go to pick up a rack of six rails, it feels light as a feather. And then when you install the rails, they are crazy strong. So you're getting the strongest and the lightest weight rail on the entire market. Now there is the drawback that you don't get to use it as integrated wire managed because of the strength and the lightweight features comes from having a fully enclosed rail. There are issues with using a channel rail for wire management. One, you can get shorts and there's water in the channel or ice in the channel and that gets in that PV connector or the trunk cable connector. Two, there are issues with cramming a bunch of wires into a small space that isn't necessarily code compliant. Sunmoto solved this problem by creating a wire clip that clips onto the side of the rail and then has slots for trunk cable and then also have slots for PV wire. These things work fantastic. You just clip it on and you pop in the wires and you go. Everything on this roof is rated for 25 years. As somebody who removed solar panel systems when they were installed wrong, I know what fails and how long those things last. So if you use all of their components on a system like this, you know you're getting a sleek, sexy installation that's going to last 25 years. Contact the guys over at Sunmoto. Try this setup out. I fell in love with it really fast. It is extremely simple. It is extremely easy. There is very few components. They're all compatible with everything. Very universal. A lot of things have multiple uses. It's one tool. Everything on the installation is black. The lag screws are black. Mid clamps are black. End clamps are black. The rail's black. Everything is black. <laughs> Absolutely love it. This installation turned out beautiful.